Looking to find a crack in the back line. It'll be an own goal that gives UCF the advantage to start here in the fifth minute. Absolutely devastating for UConn, conceding the own goal just five minutes in is not what they were looking for to start. Amen lets them in the precarious situation in the first place. But it will be another set piece coming for UCF. Andy Saray had a goal against Temple in that 48th minute of the 2-1 victory. They'll set it up. 22-yard strike right into the pause. It'll spill loose, but Kerrigan recovers. Beautiful set piece. Perfectly played. Had the teammate coming up there to the top, right to Lawrence. Lawrence, the senior, the Orlando native, scorches the palms of Kerrigan. An own goal conceded by UConn on a header back to the keeper. Top left corner just bends away. Otherwise, a great strike from Kerry Lawrence. Talk about Orlando talent, the senior from Orlando. Oh, she had eyes for that upper 90. That would have been an absolutely spectacular goal, but just continued to sail over the crossbar. Luckily for Kerrigan, it did so. Would have been her first goal on the campaign. Remember, UCF last year went through conference allowing goals to just two opponents. A 1-1 draw with USF, and the Knights have their insurance. As Stephanie Sanders, the sophomore from Hamburg, Germany. She played in that U-20 World Cup earlier this year in France. And she's no stranger to the big stage. That time finds the back of the net, 2-0. Uh, right now, she's looking for her defense to just hold UCF to these two goals. As this strike of beauty from 18. Three nothing Knights. And it's the Germans today, this time the sophomore from Berlin, Dina Orschmann. Beautiful strike from Orschmann, but give credit to the buildup. Two great passes. The ball was here on the near sideline. One ball put it into the middle. The second sent it out wide. And that is all it took. Two perfect passes, both to feed Orschmann with a beautiful strike. And it's 3 nothing Knights. She too played in that U-20 Women's World Cup in France for Germany. Looking for more. Make it four. Well, the Germans are having a day here in Stores, Connecticut. As Stephanie Sanders has a brace. Sanders, you've already seen what she can do with the left foot. Had a beautiful strike for the second goal of the match. And now a brace. She makes it 4 nothing. No matter what the score, even if the entire match is being played on the opposite half of the pitch, you'll see a keeper come well off her line, continue to keep that back line organized, as Bill put it, another coach. 1v1, and just the right gamble made by Palacios, dives to her left, and able to put it into that threat, as charging right at her, Kristen Scott. Beautiful save from Palacios, takes it off the shoelaces of Scott, and Scott, Looking to go around the goalkeeper, you'd like to see her just take that touch a bit quicker and pull the trigger. All credit to Palacios and the goal saving save. For UConn on the ball right now, Isabel Lynch. Freshman from New York will send one into the 18, but nobody to play with. And now a giveaway. Able to keep the sheet clean, but just momentarily, the Huskies are on the board. And, well, no surprise, it's Elena Santos. Santos on the spot, jumps on it. A poor giveaway in the box. The initial shot blocked. Morris there able to get a touch to it. A very nice save, but Santos with the rebound puts UConn on the board. That is three goals in four conference matches for Elena. Opportunity to come to the States, get a first class education, and play soccer at the highest levels. A win win. Another chance and the second goal of the day on the board for UConn, Deja Vu. It's a brace for Santos. Miscommunication at the back. Santos makes 
the Knights pay. And all of a sudden, it's a two-goal game. Still four and a half remaining in the first half. But what a job from the young lady who started this season in defense out of necessity. That's exactly what Coach Sahedek had to say about recruiting international players. A lot of Americans just haven't played at this level. The internationals have. This one from 19. It's a one-goal match in stores. Here come the Huskies with three straight. This time, Kolchitsky finds the back of the net, her fourth on the year. What a turn of events. The sophomore from Chappaqua, New York, turns, drills it with the right boot into the side netting, perfectly struck. Could this be the opportunity for the Huskies to level us in stores? Stopped with the kick save. And everyone just holding their breath for a moment there, but Vars secures it. What a save from the reigning conference goalkeeper of the year. Absolutely outstanding. That is why Vars is as good as she is. Able to get her leg out, just enough of it. UConn storming back. Knights looking for their first goal in the second half. And what an adjustment. Slipping to the pitch, it is a hat trick on the day for the sophomore from Hamburg, Stephanie Sanders. The Werder Bremen product with a beautiful cutback here around the final defender, loses her footing, but cuts it back. And I'm sure that is what she meant to do, even though she lost her footing, she saw the space to the near post, went with precision over power,